parents, today I'm going to show you how I taught your child how to read a subtraction strip diagram. So let's look at our word problem here. Nancy went to the store with $25. She spent $13. How much money did she have left? So we're going to do the same thing like we did with the uh, addition strip diagram. We're going to draw a rectangle. Now, we know, our, we know our total. Our total is $25. And just like the subtraction strip diagram, we're going to put that here on the bottom. This right here tells me my total. The total goes on the bottom. The kids already know that the total always goes on the bottom. Now, inside our rectangle, we know how much she spent. She spent $13. So I'm going to separate uh, the rectangle. This $13 is going to go in one box. This is how much she spent. We are trying to find how much she has left. Now, I told the kids to think of it like an addition strip diagram. This number plus this number will give me 25. So they know that if there's one box that's empty inside of the uh, strip diagram and it gives you your total, they know that they have to subtract. So they come to the side and they're going to subtract 25, oops, sorry, minus 13. 5 minus 3 is 2, 2 minus 1 is 1. Now I've told them if you want to, you can check your work. So let's see if 13 plus 12 equals 25. 3 plus 2 equals 5, and 1 plus 1 equals 2. So they know that they have done their subtraction strip diagram correctly. So sometime this week, I will be also showing you the multiplication and division strip diagram. If you have any questions or comments, leave me a message, call me or text me. Thanks.